Uh, and we have been consistent in our approach with China. Uh, we welcome stiff competition, but do we not? We don't do not want that competition to veer into conflict. And that is certainly what we convey privately as well. It is our legal responsibility to safely care for unaccompanied children until they swiftly can be swiftly unified with a parent or a vetted sponsor. And that's something we take seriously. We have a moral, a right obligation to uh, com to do that and to deliver on that. You're going to tell from up there future generations, not even born yet, that they're not on the hook for this. Is that right? That's right. And hopefully you'll report accurate information yourself. And of course, this week she said, well, you know, the supply chain crisis is really about people not getting their treadmill and is arguing with reporters over whether or not 2.30 2 in the morning for these illegal immigrant flights and, you know, into airports, is that that's really the middle of the night or not? Chris Wallace, however, giving Jen Psaki his stamp of approval and another sign of a leftward, leftward pivot from Fox News, calling Psaki one of the best press secretaries ever. Take a listen. Jen Psaki, I think, is a, one of the best press secretaries ever. I know it's a short clip, folks, but I just I had to play it. Uh, Siri, he, he was a White House correspondent. How could he possibly say that? Well, honestly, I miss the days of Chris's dad, Mike Wallace, where a reporter and someone who espouses to be a journalist operated an objective fact. I mean, whatever standard that we use for a White House prec secretary, the point of these press briefings is to convey facts to the American people. And whatever I think of Jennifer personally, I think she is a great mother and she's a great human individual. The White House press secretary should give facts. And yeah. that is not what is coming out of the White House press room because the World Wide Web exists. Yeah. We can Google these facts like you were mentioning, that they are literally flying thousands of illegal immigrants from my home state, Texas, to New York, to California, right. to Nevada. Je we are operating also under the facts that we have left 300 Americans in Afghanistan right. and they want to come home. So the standard of the White House press secretary's facts, Jen has failed. Yeah, but as a human, she's great. Je uh, Jeff, I, I need, need to get you in. And uh, I'm, I'm sure you, you disagree with Chris Wallace's assessment, but I do want to ask you, who do you think was the best press secretary? Because you, you've, been, you've been in this, in this business for a long time. I would I would go back to uh, before my when I long before I was an adult to Pierre Salinger who was JFK's press secretary and he was a good one and you know notably when the Kennedy administration screwed up basically with the Bay of Pigs not only was JFK himself saying it's my responsibility I'm the responsible officer of the government Pierre Salinger was out there saying you know we did the wrong thing well that's that's a good thing. That's what uh, yeah. a press secretary should say is just be honest. And that's not what's happening here. All right. Well, thanks, uh, Siri Sabolsky, uh, Rick Gates, and Jeffrey Lord. We're going to see you right after the break. Thanks. Hey, I'm Rob Finnerty. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please join the conversation in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe, too. Hit the bell icon to be alerted to breaking news. And remember, there's a whole lot more on Newsmax TV, America's fastest growing cable news network. Newsmax TV, where real news for real people.